thanks to our assessor recorder, who actually has shed a lot of light on, on the foreclosure crisis that we're facing. There's a report that showed that most of these foreclosures have actually some legal violation that comes with them. Uh, and I also want to acknowledge uh, uh, Supervisor Avalos for the leadership that he has shown on this issue of foreclosures. And the, the work of the community members is something that cannot be emphasized enough. And I especially want to uh, acknowledge the work that Occupy Bernal uh, is doing, not only focusing on the foreclosures in Bernal Heights, but in foreclosures throughout the city. When you think about it, that, a, that banks, which have made billions of dollars for closing homes, that those banks do not pay a transfer tax on the billions of dollars that they're making is really, it adds uh, insult to injury. It is really disgraceful that banks can make so much money and yet in San Francisco, when that property is transferred, when that property is foreclosed, they don't pay anything. As a matter of fairness, we have to make sure that they're accountable. Uh, and quite frankly, this is, I think, one step that brings us closer to making sure that we're doing everything we can as a city. I still think that we need to figure out what else can be done uh, here locally to make sure that we do everything possible to defend the rights of these uh, property owners whose homes are being foreclosed. There are also tenants uh, whose uh, rights and interests are implicated here. So this is a step in the right direction, but we need to do more. And I want to thank again uh, the community members, the elected officials, uh, especially Assessor Recorder Ting and Supervisor Avalos for making this po uh, possible. And let's keep fighting. Thank you. Thank you.